بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم In the name of Allah, the entirely merciful, the especially merciful. اقرأ باسم ربك الذي خلق Recite in the name of your Lord who created. اقرأ باسم ربك الذي خلق Read, learn, teach, propagate, share. In the name of your God Lord provide a creator. Who created everything. اقرأ باسم ربك الذي خلق The message in the Quran is to connect directly ourselves spiritually to God who is the Lord and the Cherisher. This is a continuation of the previous divine messages like Vedas, Torah Bible etc. Came through his representative, the last messenger, Muhammad to pass to the entire humanity. اقرأ باسم ربك الذي خلق This is how revelation of Quran started in the cave hera of Jabal Nur, through the angel Jibreel. When the Prophet was 40 years old this is how he was commissioned as a final messenger of God. Created man from a clinging substance. Recite, and your Lord is the most generous. Quran says, Learn about all provision and resources God has graciously provided in and around you, so that they can be used for the service of man. Who taught by the pen. Quran says, Make use of reading and writing materials for advancing our knowledge about ourselves and about our surroundings so that we can make use of them for our needs of food, clothing, shelter, health, transport, exploring our surroundings of land, sea and other cosmic surroundings it directly indicates to learn about Creator and His directions to the human beings. Taught man that which he knew not. Quran says, That when we try to learn about anything God helps us to the new areas of knowledge we are not familiar with this is how knowledge advances in all subject matters. No, but indeed, man transgresses. Man by his own nature is inclined to do anything in his own way. Without guidance from his creator, he may not have direction to reach the desired goal. Here God is indicating, man has to follow God's advice, otherwise man is likely to end up in wrong direction. Because he sees himself self-sufficient. Quran says, By nature man wants to be independent both in action and thinking. He feels free and self-sufficient. This attitude is counterproductive. He has to connect himself both the mind to mind and following the divine advice. Indeed, to your Lord is the return. Going back to God after this life is a statement in almost all divine messages. How and when is this return trip is not clear to us.